What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. As you can saw from the very beginning, I have a coolant leak on my Infinity FX35 2011. Uh, this car has 105,532 miles. I don't know where the leak is exactly coming from, but it is coming from the front end, uh, not from the engine or anything. So I'm suspecting that the coolant leak is from the radiator. Uh, I tried looking under the hood and trying to see where the leak is, but I just could not see with the fans and the AC condenser and everything. So, so I'm going to my friend David's shop right now at DD Auto Care in Philadelphia. So uh, he's going to help me take a look and see where the leak is coming from. But I am, like I said, suspecting that it is a radiator leak. So I kind of purchased a, um, a radiator just in case it is the radiator. Uh, I bought the Denso one. I bought it from, uh, what is it, from rockauto.com for a really, really good price. So yeah, I'm just going to try to get that fixed right now on this car. This is my wife's daily, so she needs to get it fixed as soon as possible. Job. I see people online, mm -hmm. they uh, take this AC condenser yeah. out, push it, yeah, and then they slide it out, yeah. Normally I would do the radiator myself, but uh, it's getting kind of cold. I don't have all my tools here, so I'd rather just, you know, support my friend uh, in his shop and let him do what he does best. So him and his dad been in the business for over 30 years, so uh, I trust them with all my cars. So I'm just gonna sit back and relax and let them do their thing and kind of show you the progress here and there, like what they're up to, the current status. But yeah, right now, um, David's dad is starting to remove the radiator and everything. Yo, check out this little guy, yo. David just got a new uh, shop dog. It's a puppy. It's a Shiba Inu. His name is Subi. Dedicated to his STI. <laughs> What's up, little buddy? Oh, he's so cute. No, he's just like the he's just like the same size as Mochi, just a little bit smaller. He's got his puppy teeth right now. Oh my god, he's gonna get big to like twenty five pounds. Uh, David says. Yeah. Hey, little buddy. What's up? Hey, no biting. No biting. AC condenser uh, he had to pull it out just so that there's some space for him to pull out the radiator the radiator is about to come out we pull out the AC condenser and you can see that leak right there uh, I'll show you guys in a bit once uh, once we pull this old radiator out the old one is out the leak is somewhere here Alright, so here is the new one and compared to the old one, we're just swapping over the mounting grommets. Alright, the new radiator is in. Everything's all buttoned up. Uh, he's just recharging the AC because we took out the AC condenser. There are ways to remove the radiator without taking the AC condenser, but uh, I mean, it's a lot easier for him just to do everything with, uh, without it. So. Uh, we just buttoned everything up, uh, he just recharged the AC, now we're going to refill it with coolant. The whole thing takes 2 gallons. Alright guys, so that is it for today's video. Uh, fix the radiator leak. Uh, thanks to my boy David for helping me out. His dad uh, pretty much did the replacement for me. So here, no more leak. Uh, yeah, it's kind of dark right now. Yeah, so I've been driving the car for about a whole two weeks now, ever since the replacement. And 
So far, no leaks. The car has about like 105,000 miles. So uh, 5,000 miles ago, I changed the alternator. So, you know, there's gonna be some uh, maintenance that needs to be done with this car. I did the spark plugs, I uh, did the MAF sensor cleaning, cleaned out the throttle body. But so far, this car has been wonderful to me. Like there's absolutely no problems uh, other than just like these little minor stuff. So they're not that expensive to do. And also if you were, if you had the tools and the time to do it yourself, like I, you know, you can do that. But my garage is small, as you can see, uh, I can't really work on the car. So that's why I brought it to my friend David's shop. So yeah, uh, hope you guys enjoy and we'll see you guys next time. Peace out.